Well, so what do you do when it's raining outside on a nice, warm spring evening? Uh, well, you stay inside. Or, tonight, exactly. Tonight <laughs> might have been the night to do that. And uh, one opportunity was to take in a play. That's right. Stay inside or take in a play. It's exactly what some people did at De Pere High School. Fox 11's Becky DeReese explains what makes this play different from the others. <laughs> More than 30 De Pere High School students are entertaining on the stage, performing a Shakespearean romantic comedy of sorts. It's about a guy named David uh, being helplessly in love with the king's daughter. The play not only has a unique cast of characters, its author, Skylar Wonderish, also co-directed. Only a few years ago, he was involved with the drama department at the high school as a student. It is a little weird. I think that being so close to uh, like their age is actually a good thing more than a bad thing because I can relate to him a little more. And I remember being in their shoes a couple years ago. Wandrish graduated from De Pere High School in 2007 when he wrote a different play which was also performed here. Wandrish studied at Columbia College and UW Green Bay and says he enjoys working on his original productions. The original material, everyone puts a few suggestions in and then it becomes a completely new product towards the end and it's everyone's input so everyone feels really close to it. it showcases the talent of uh, students that we have. I mean, he's a former student, but he's only 20 years old. And the reaction to the performance Wondrish has helped create is memorable. I just felt um, relieved and rewarded because people were laughing throughout the whole thing. Wondrish hopes seeing his productions come to life becomes a common occurrence. He plans to continue his education in California later this year and hopes to have a career in film. As long as I'm around, kind of what I have a passion for, I'll be happy. In De Pere, Becky DeVries, Fox 11 News. The play is titled For the Love of So-and-So. De Pere High School students will be giving their final performance of the play tomorrow night at 7 o'clock.